Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and somebody sent me a logo with this letter A in it. I've, they asked me not to show the rest of the logo. Um, don't really know why, but it doesn't matter. And but they did know the font that the whoever the used, and so she actually sent me the font. It's a pretty cool font called Lemon Milk. Um, I did a little typing with it. I think it only comes in capital letters. But she sent me a the logo, and I deleted all the other part of the logo. She just didn't know how to do this A. So to do this correctly, and this is a JPEG of it, so you can see the size is 12 inches tall, where this A is only 8, but they're exactly the same size because this is a photograph. So to do that, I had to bring in A. I'm going to turn it yellow. And I just brought it over and matched it on size because that's going to be pretty important to get the size of this notch correctly. So I'm just going to zoom in here. I'm going to measure this. And it's roughly, it's kind of hard to say, but with the fuzziness, 0.33 of an inch apart. So this is very easily done. Take your A, left click, right click. We need to go ahead and turn it to a curve. Then we need to change our nudge distance on 0.33. So make sure you're checked off anything. 0.33. We're going to draw a line from there to that node to that node. We're going to make a duplicate of that line. Control D. And we're going to nudge it over that 0.33. Now just take your virtual segment delete key and delete these two blinds and use your smart fill tool and see what's happened there. This photograph is in the way of us doing this. So let's get this JPEG out of the way and now let's smart fill it and you see it fills it in all. Then just take your smart fill away. You can actually delete or just move this out of the way or weld it together and then you have it done. But those are two identical logos and I think it's dead on. And from the rest you can take it out and finish the logo. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.